here to showcase the PageWriter TC Series cardiographs. First, we have the TC70, which has a 15-inch foldable screen and is able to acquire and analyze up to 16 leads of ECG. Next is the TC50, has a 10-inch screen and is also able to acquire 16 leads of ECG. And finally, the TC30 has a 6-inch screen and can acquire a 12-lead ECG. The Philips PageWriter TC family of cardiographs have all the same easy-to-use software. All the cardiographs support the latest Philips DXL algorithm with diagnostic reports that follow newly updated guidance and recommendations from the medical community. The cardiographs are touchscreen or hard key. All leads are displayed on the PageWriter TC screen as the patient cable is connected. Leads are color-coded green, yellow, or red and show individual lead quality. Lead reversal warnings appear in a pop-up window. Lead map is a guide for correct lead placement. Step one is to touch the blue map icon in the lower left corner to display the lead placement locations. If a lead connection is bad, a red X will appear next to its lead label. If all leads are correctly placed and picking up strong signals, then the next step may be performed. When the patient is connected, the patient ID button will light up to guide you to the next step, completing patient data entry. Step two is to touch the yellow ID icon. This opens a window to enter the patient information. Only the blue fields are required for the ECG to be correctly documented. Fields that are required are determined by the cardiograph owner when it is installed. When all the required patient data is complete, the ECG button will light up to guide you to preview the ECG. The patient's ID, name, and date of birth are displayed at the top of the moving waveform display so that the operator can verify that the correct patient was selected from the order work list. The default layout of the 12-lead ECG when it is printed is configured in the cardiograph. For example, the configuration may default to a standard 3x4 with a single rhythm lead 2. However, that can be changed on the fly with the current ECG being taken if desired without changing the default settings in the cardiograph. For example, to change the print layout to 3x4 with three rhythm leads, 2, AVF, and V5, touch Layout and select Report Format. Filters, lead selection, paper speed, and gain may all be changed on the fly if necessary, but the cardiograph default settings will automatically reset for the next patient. See how the changes are selected. This will result in the printed ECG. Now you have your 12 lead with three rhythm leads. Step three is to touch the green ECG icon. The completed ECG with analysis report appears within seconds. The four operations near the upper right of the ECG may be performed independently or linked together for ease of use and to ensure that all four are performed. Print the ECG on the cardiograph recorder. Save the ECG in the memory of the PageWriter TC. Using the down arrow on the PageWriter, a different view of the ECG may be seen and printed if desired. For example, the three rhythm leads are shown here. This is an example of the 12 lead with lead two rhythm along with the ST maps graphically showing ST changes. This view shows all 12 leads simultaneously and may be printed as well. I hope you enjoyed this short video on the Philips PageWriter family of cardiographs. Please feel free to contact your local cardiology sales specialist for a quote or further questions. Innovation 